and this is Yusuf here, um, and, uh, for proof, even though you can see my profile, um, and I'm coming from, uh, the Antiochian Orthodox Church, and I've read, well, the, uh, last seven years of my life have been devoted to Orthodoxy. I'd like to see, uh, Bionic Dan strike tango with me, because, uh, David be with him. Good guy, I've, uh, been on his, uh, his roundtable discussions, but I think he's too analytical, and he's polite to the point of letting the other person run roughshod over him. I do not have this attitude. Um... People like Big Lundy know my background, and so do other people. So I do not tolerate um, pushy people. And uh, this will be the third time, or as I, in the less American way, the third time I'm issuing the challenge to Bionic Dance. Bionic Dance. If you think you can defeat a theist, somebody who's representing classical orthodox thought, uh, I would be the one to defeat. I am the bulwark against uh, this form of anti-theism. Bill Zubob met his demise while trying to come against me and had to strawman me and lie Bionic Dance, or should I call you Kate? If you're not willing to lie, if you are willing to engage in an honest discussion, I am not here to proselytize you, but as you may know, there is no proselytizing in Orthodoxy, neither is there a heaven or a hell, and Jesus did not, we don't believe Jesus died as a blood sacrifice for us to appease either God or Satan. Um, we do not believe in original sin. If you can make any headway in your argument against me, then that would have vast repercussions. Vast. So I issue this challenge, not not necessarily a challenge, but an invitation. I invite you to talk with me and discuss any of the problems that you have with uh, orthodoxy. Um, and remember, when I say... I don't accept the ideas of heaven and hell, and I don't really give a damn about an afterlife. I'm not stepping outside of orthodoxy. I'm being exactly concise in a belief that has existed for 2,000 years. If you're looking to debate somebody who believes in some type of modern jam band Christianity, uh, look somewhere else. But if you're if you want to actually attack the heart of orthodoxy, come against me. I'm, uh, me and Archbishop Lazar have a very good rapport with each other, so I'm not stepping out of bounds into heresy. I'm not bringing anything new. In fact, there's an old joke. Uh, how many orthodox does it take to change a light bulb? Change? What is change? So I would love to talk to you, Kate, also known as Bionic Dance. I'll let you record it. <clears throat> I will, um... I will put my trust in the fact that you will not craftily edit it. And, uh, so you can have full control over recording it. But, uh... Well, I guess that's it. The gauntlet has been thrown down. Bionic Dance. 
If you think David, well, I won't bring up David's name again. You have not seen the likes of me. I guarantee it. How many Christians have you ran into that actually believe in heaven or hell? Um, or think that Jesus is going to save them from some, in some fashion of them heaping their bloody sins upon Christ so that he could get murdered. Um, I don't think you've ever seen anything like me before. If you truly can defeat all theists, prove yourself by trying to defeat me. Uh, little background on my part. Raised in Islam, and uh, as many atheists who have talked to me, I've lived a more rougher life than you have, a harder life than you have, and have experienced more prejudice and racism than you have. So I'd love to just talk to you. Let's just talk peaceably. And if there's ideas that come up that need to be debated, I'm ready, willing, and able to do that. Gauntlet has been thrown down for you, Bionic Dance. If you don't pick it up, I will... I don't know, I guess I'll just say that, uh, well, I guess I couldn't say that you don't have the balls, but, uh, that you don't have the minerals to, uh, defend your position against me, because I don't tolerate straw men, and I have not lived in an ivory tower. Neighborhoods that I grew up in, you'd be terrified to walk through. Do I even give a damn about an afterlife? Most of the people who know me would say, uh, no, he doesn't care about one. And yet, I am extremely religious. Pray three times a day fast three times a week. I'm probably the most religious person you've ever come across. So, Bionic Dance, are you ready to have a discussion with me? You might know me from my old channel, uh, John the Hut Dweller, which was supposed to be a composite. So, I'd love to talk to you, and, uh, I know David P. with him. He's a very polite, understanding, calm man. I am exceedingly respectful, and I will give you ample time to, uh, make your argument. Um, but, uh, I'd love to see how this goes, and if you crush me in a debate, You can have all my subscribers. How about that one? Billsy Bob couldn't stand up to me. Or I guess his new name, Generic God Killer. Killer! Generic God Killer! So, there it goes. This is number three. So, uh, let's see what you can do.